Hello everyone, welcome back to Hotline Topics. Umitorella shocks Nigerians today and our alleged in-law also reveals some unknown truths. Umitorella is among the top actresses in the Yoruba sector of Nollywood and she is also amongst the married ones. In fact, she has a son and a while ago she had opened up about how she met her husband it was love at first sight and all those things and how easy it was for her husband to get her as she is not usually that easy for men they had met via facebook the man had contacted her and that was how their love started their jeremy actress tied the knot some years ago and made things official with this man who was a u.s based man and well, after about a year and some months plus, they welcomed their son. Of course, Wumi has been, over the years, entertaining her fans with some sneak peek on her personal life, sharing some moments with her husband and her adorable son on social media platforms. So many people have grown to love Wumi's family. Of course, apart from her own unique personality and the way she interprets her rules. Over time, when stars have problems in their marriages, one way or the other, it gets to the social media. And before we know it, it will be circulated on all news platforms. That has not been the case with Umitoriola. For years now, we've not heard anything at all about the couple, them having any problem or anything like that. It has been like a blissful marriage, all true. However, a shocking news hits the internet less than 24 hours ago. Gist Lover's blog wrote something about Wumi's marriage and Wumi also shared a post on our official social media platform that seems to confirm this news. This was how Just Lovers shared the news. Actress Wumi to realize marriage crashes, she beat Aitokam that time, then say Just Lover na hate her, yeah, yeah. The other in her papa realized say this na gossip blog the better. In a go cry tear style, I go still report stories. In a kuku no say, I know they look in a papa face. Amy ka, we ya look away. Who no like him? Make them go jump inside Todd Miller Bridge. Well, you know, don't hear him from the horse's mouth. Be like, we missed out of hiding, the bunking and damage control in the mouth too. First time info new, no be caught and join the way. Get the work power, I come in peace. In the short clip Wumi shared, she was seen dancing to the thing, and it was said, Are you married? With the tag single and married. Wumi then acted as if she wanted to go to the married side, but she was given a hot slap, and then she moved to the single side. Of course, this gives a different message that Wumi is no longer married, and her marital status has been changed to single. And a tag on this post was someone said, I've twisted the caption. I don't put single for a marry for a day. A lot of people started commenting on this. Our colleagues and fans all over the world. Many people had questions. While some people were consoling her and telling her, oh, uh, she should face her business. Don't mind people. They were shocked that she moved to the single side. What a person with the handle Palace Lopez commented and said, I'm glad it came from you meaning you're working well on your inner circle something that has been over two years and please don't respond to anyone i'm your in-law and i know you really tried so let anyone run their mouths well this packed some people as they started insulting this person who said is the in-law we gave you more details about this alleged divorce or separation and they started saying that the person is radio without battery the in-law has a big mouth and some people who were totally against this news started praying against it, casting out the devil and advising women that she has a beautiful family. She should not let the devil come into her family and destroy things. Well, this is really a sad news as the family look really good together and it is a family unit, the institution of marriage. As they say, it seems the devil is really against the institution of marriage these days. As many marriages are crashing, we see them on the internet, people giving updates. Some single people are even saying that they are of getting married because of what they see on social media platforms. However, 
Some also say that the people who are enjoying their marriages do not bring it on social media platforms. So you can't really use those ones you see on social media as yardstick for your own personal life. So as it is now, the news is that Umi's marriage allegedly has crashed. This is sad. Of course, a lot of actors have complained over the years that it seems there's a problem with actors' marriages. Even though we've seen some that they are enjoying their marriages and they've lasted for quite some time now. Some even got married to their colleagues. They are in the same entertainment industry. Well, contrary to this, some also hit the rocks. Like the marriage of Funke Akindele Bilu just some months ago. It also started as rumors and sadly it was confirmed that the two parted ways, Baba Beji and Mama Beji, their fans were also saddened by this news. How did this marriage crash? How did things become so bad that the two could not live together as husband and wife anymore, even though they have beautiful sons in between? Well, even though many people are focused on the marriages of entertainers, but regular people to get divorced, get separated, even though that is not the best, of course. However, some people say that it is better for them to go their separate ways. Some unions are just bound to hit the rocks. As I mentioned, Bumi Toriola got married to this man who is based in the US after they met on social media, specifically on Facebook. And they got married in May 2018. Then in 2019, she gave it to their son, Zion. Bumi is currently in her 30s. Uh, some sources say 34 years old. She was born on July 11th. Wumi, after earning a diploma in Odunfa Kakos in the year 2009, this was when she first acted in the movie Isheshi Lagba. And then she ventured into acting fully. After that, she featured on the movies Aji Wumi, Amomo Beta, Lurititi Eto Obiri, My Past, Dobu Dobu, Iyaje, Baba Tunde Ishola, Fulon Show, The Ring, Atorishi. She also won the Six People Movie Awards for the fastest rising actress of the year. She said to be among the best actresses in the Yoruba sector of Nollywood. So, of course, a lot of her fans will be saddened by this. As they've grown to love her family, not just her craft, they've also grown to love her husband, her son, they love their pictures on social media and all that, all those lovey dovey stuff. So, this is the end of this episode. Please subscribe and hit the bell icon for daily content.